Here are the highlights of the 32nd fiscal period. Let's look at the external growth first. As you can see, the company has conducted property replacement. Purchasing HF Tabata residents from Heiwa Real Estate, our sponsor, and selling Anwa Tsukasamachi building. I should note that with this replacement, we managed to turn the unrealized loss for the building into realized profit. During the current 33rd fiscal period, although it has started only recently, the company has already implemented portfolio replacement, selling HF Shin Yokohama building and purchasing two buildings, namely HF Ryogoku residence from our sponsor and HF Hachioji residence from an outside seller. As a result of promotion of replacement strategies and also due to the upward rent revisions and the falling cap rates among other reasons, unrealized gains increased even further. And since the sponsor change, we've been posting record high results for eight consecutive periods. Let's look at the internal growth now. The company again managed to successfully maintain the average occupancy rate at a high level, almost the same as our record high. With offices, the rent increase expanded further. In the company's financial operation, we have issued investment corporation bonds in June, yet another measure to diversify funds procurement methods, which further helped us to reduce financing costs. Appraised-based LTV continued to fall which in turn resulted in an increase of our ability to acquire properties. And here are the financial performance values. Operating revenue was 5,881 million yen, up 54 million yen from the previous period. Operating income was up 35 million yen, and ordinary income up 41 million yen at 2,048 million yen. Net income was 1,904 million yen, with a dividend increase of 37 yen from the previous period, distribution per unit was 2,054 yen. Lastly, I would like to say a few words about our growth strategy. And well, here the course of action is more than clear. All we need to do is continue to steadily implement it. Firstly, in terms of external growth, the company will continue to conduct measures to ensure that it is making a healthy and steady progress. We shall not make any rash decisions and make investments only on the basis of careful selection. And if we find good properties, we will put to good use our borrowing capacity to flexibly make acquisitions. In the following area of internal growth, we shall ensure that we maintain the current high occupancy rate centering on the presently operated offices. As for residences, we believe that there is still some room for improvement there which is why we intend to implement measures to increase the occupancy rate further. Also, we shall make an effort to expand our rent earnings through rent increases centering on the offices. In the area of financial operation, we intend to continue implementing measures to create a solid financial structure, issue investment corporation bonds, etc. when needed, and reduce financial costs further. Forecast for distribution is 2,080 yen for the 33rd fiscal period and 2,100 yen for the 34th period. On a mid- and long-term basis, the company intends to reach a figure of 2,250 yen, and we would like to achieve this target as early as possible and establish the next goal.